So in this question, we're given that the uh, height of a triangle is three centimeters more than the base, and that the area of the triangle is 17 centimeters squared. And the first thing that's going to help you is if you write the formula for area of a triangle, which is area is equal to base times height divided by two. And if that's the only thing that was a stumbling block for you, go back and try this question again and come back to the video later. So we're going to write a let statement here. We're going to say let x represent the height, the uh, base of the triangle. And since the height is three centimeters more than the base, then we're going to say let x plus three represent the height. So now we're going to sub into the equation for base is x and height is x plus 3. And so area is equal to x times, and sorry, I should put in the value for a because we know that the from the question, we know that the area is 17 centimeters squared, so we can sub in 17 for the area. And this is going to be x times x plus 3 divided by 2. So this doesn't look much like a quadratic equation yet. So what we're going to do is simplify where we can. And first thing, the fraction is an issue. So we're going to get rid of the fraction by multiplying everything by 2. So we have to multiply both sides of the equation by 2. And when we do that, the twos cancel. And so when we, even if we ex, uh, expand here, this is going to be x squared plus 3x. And over here, we have 34. And so if we put it into a quadratic equation form, this is going to be x squared plus 3x. And we're going to subtract 34 from both sides. So minus 34 is equal to 0. So here is our quadratic equation that we're going to use in order to solve the problem. Um, if you note, though, uh, it's not easily factorable. So here's the quadratic equation that we found in the first part of the question. And we're going to use quadratic formula in order to solve for which values of x make this equation true. In other words, what values of x make x squared plus uh, 3x minus 34 equal to 0. And so we're going to use our quadratic formula. And remember, we have to correctly identify a, b, and c from our quadratic equation. So a here is 1, b is positive 3, and c is negative 34. And so when we sub into our quadratic formula, we end up, uh, and simplifying, you should end up with negative 3 plus or minus square root of 9 plus 136, which is 145 over 2. So if we consider the situation, remember this is plus or minus, so if we consider the situation where we're adding, then what we end up with is, uh, after simplifying, 4.52. And so then remember that this is the length of the base, x is the, represents the length of our base, and so our height is 3 centimeters more than that, so x plus 3 then would be 7.52. Now, the situation here, remember this is plus or minus, we have to consider the uh, situation where we're subtracting uh, the square root, the, the discriminant, then um, what we're going to end up with then is x is equal to negative 7.52, and we can immediately eliminate that because we cannot have a negative value for the base length. And so what we're going to use then is our formula just to check to see if we got the right answer. We're going to sub in for base is 4.52 and height is 7.52 and when we do that and simplify we find that the area is equal to approximately 17 centimeters squared it's a little off because um, remember this, that we've rounded this to the nearest one hundredth in each case and so these are approximate answers so therefore the base and height of the triangle are approximately 
4.52 centimeters and 7.52 centimeters respectively.